In this video, we will go over another factoring method. This one will involve perfect square trinomials. So there's gonna be two types. Factor the sum of perfect cube, factor the difference of perfect cube. So you could have a cubed plus b cubed. And when we factor, it would be this, parentheses a plus b, close parentheses, parentheses a squared minus ab plus b squared, close parentheses. Now, if you have a cubed minus b cubed, then the answer will be parentheses a minus b, close parentheses, parentheses a squared plus ab plus b squared. And we will solve two problems, x cubed plus eight and x cubed minus eight. And so if you want to pause the video, feel free. So x cubed plus eight. So you could say x cubed plus two cubed. And so we're going to use factor the sum of perfect cube. And we would get x plus two, close parentheses, parentheses x squared minus two x, plus two squared. And then two squared can become four. And we can always check, let's expand. X times X squared is X cubed. X times negative two X is negative two X squared. X times four is four X. Two times X squared is two X squared. Two times negative two X is negative four X. And two times four is eight. So negative two X squared cancels with two X squared. Four X cancels with negative four X and we're left off with x cubed plus eight. Now for the second problem, x cubed minus eight. So we would get x cubed minus two cubed. And so this is what we would get, parentheses x minus two, close parentheses, x squared plus two x plus two squared. We're simply using this, factor the difference of perfect cube. And we can always check. So x times x squared is x cubed. x times two x is two x squared. x times four is four x. Negative two times x squared is negative two x squared. Negative two times two x is negative four x. And negative two times four is negative eight. So two x squared cancels with negative two x squared. Four x cancels with negative four x. And we finally have x cubed minus eight. And that's all we need to do for these types of problems.